Welcome back to another video tutorial brought to you by TheVirtualInstructor.com. Today I'm going to show you how to make a growing animation in Adobe Flash CS4. It's very easy to do. I'm uh, just going to show you how to create a masking layer and then the rest is just pushing a couple buttons over and over again. So this is, uh, you're looking at what we're going to be making here. It's just real simple but you can be creative and make something really exciting out of this. And this is how you do it. We'll just close this file right here and we'll close that file right there and we'll start with a brand new document you want to make sure that you're in ActionScript 3.0 and um, we've got just a standard blank document right here um, down here in the timeline I'm gonna go ahead and layer uh, name layer 1 mask and that's gonna be important in just a minute but right now we're gonna go ahead and name it mask and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw the shape that we want to be growing. Now you can create something in Illustrator and bring it over if you'd like to, um, but I'm just going to make kind of the shape, a shape like this, a curly Q looking thing. That'll be good. That'll work. Okay, and you can see it's a solid black line right now. So what we're going to do next is we're going to create a new layer down here, and we're going to name this layer Artwork. just like that. So we've got an artwork layer, we've got a mask layer. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pull this mask layer on top of the artwork layer. So the mask layer is on top, artwork layer is underneath. Then I'm going to right click on the mask layer and I'm going to select mask. We're creating a mask so you want to select mask. Alright, immediately everything disappears up here. It's okay, it's no problem. And you can see the artwork's got this little checkerboard thing next to it and the mask has this little mask symbol next to it. If we unlock both of those, you'll see that the artwork comes back. Now we want to click on this little outline box so only the outlines are shown. And we'll go back to the artwork layer and you can see we're left with this. All right, now what we're going to do is we're going to slowly fill in this shape as we go up. And when we animate it, when we export it, it'll look like it's filling in. So to do that, we're going to pick our color and I'm going to stick with red. And I'm going to select the brush and make sure that my brush is kind of big to begin with so we're not doing this all day. Um, and I'm going to start right here at the bottom because I want it to grow up from the bottom and come up like this. So I'm just going to fill in a little bit. And it's okay if you go over the lines because that is being masked. So it's only going to show up on the inside of that. Then I'm going to hit F6 and go to the next keyframe. And I'm just going to keep repeating this. And as I go... I'm hitting F6. So it's F6, draw a little bit, F6, draw a little bit, F6. You get the idea. Now when I'm getting up to this little point right here, I want to be very careful because I don't want to create something that looks like there's little edges coming off this middle part. So to, to do that, I'm going to zoom in and make sure I'm real careful in this area. And I'll just go ahead and go straight across like that. And look, I even went a little too far so I'm going to be very careful just like that, that's a little better alright then we'll pick it back up and I'll zoom back out to save some time and so color F6, color F6 now it's probably going to speed up a little bit right there because but I'll slow down first and then speed up because I uh, zoomed in and made smaller marks and then zoomed out and made larger marks. So you can control the speed at which this thing grows. We'll see if we can get it to slow down just a little bit right here. Right here in the turn and I'll show you what I mean. I think it's pretty self-explanatory. Now we'll get it to speed up a little bit and you can control the animation speed this way which would be kind of cool if you want and then there we go covered the whole end remember it's a process of hitting F6 and then coloring in and let's see what it looks like so we'll just export that and you can see we got a nice growing shape there and remember you can do this with anything that you create in Adobe Illustrator and bring it over into Flash it doesn't have to be something that you drew completely in Flash I hope this helps you out with all your creations. Uh, this has been another video tutorial brought to you by the virtualinstructor.com.